the Trump administration seems to have been using the coronavirus pandemic as a reason to follow up on Trump's long-held desire to keep immigrants out of the country. On Wednesday, however, a federal judge ordered the administration to stop expelling underage migrants, throwing into question the government's practice of keeping migrants out of the country because of the coronavirus pandemic. U.S. District Judge Emmett Sullivan, the same judge presiding over former National Security Advisor Michael Flynn's case, issued a preliminary injunction that requires the administration to process the humanitarian claims of minors who cross the U.S. Mexico border alone instead of forcing them back into Mexico or flying them back to their home countries without due process. In March, the Trump administration had implemented emergency public health measures with the goal of preventing the spread of COVID-19 in border stations, detention centers, and child migrant shelters. More than 200,000 migrants have been expelled from the country since then, including many unaccompanied underage migrants. It's unknown what will happen to this law under President-elect Joe Biden's administration. With a worsening situation in Mexico and Central America, it could lead to a larger push north, at a time when illegal border crossings have been at their highest levels in more than a year. Biden has not said whether he would continue this policy, but he has vowed to revoke Trump administration measures that affect access to the U.S. court system and asylum protections. Immigrant advocates had argued that the government has been violating anti-trafficking laws and other protections the law gives to minors. This is an enormous step, said Lee Gallant. Deputy Director of the Immigrants' Rights Project at the American Civil Liberties Union. If people need to be tested and quarantined, so be it, but the government can't just expel them without a hearing, argued Gallant. There are more than 14,000 minors to have been expelled since March, according to ACLU estimates. The ACLU's position is that the administration has exceeded its legal authority. Judge Sullivan seems to be of the view that public health laws don't permit the expulsion of anyone, but he also rested his decision on statutes protecting children and asylum seekers, so we're continuing to evaluate the ruling, said Gallant. The administration is expected to seek an immediate stay on the injunction and appeal the judge's ruling. A Department of Homeland Security spokesman, Chase Jennings, called Sullivan an activist judge.